Welcome to the Seedlinked platform. Thank you for being part of our community. We appreciate your participation. Today I am covering how to review your garden on the Seedlink platform. Please check out our previous videos, how to use the Seed Explorer and create a wish list, and how to make a planting from a wish list before diving into this video. First off, I want to encourage you to check out the Seedlink apps on the Apple Store or Google Play. The apps allow you to use the platform on your smartphone or tablet while on the go. So let's get started on reviewing your garden on the Seedlink platform. Log into your Seedlink profile and go to the Track tab. Below are all the plantings you are a part of for your growing season. These are either collaborative trials or plantings that you've made yourself. On the left hand tab, click on Plantings. You are welcome to search your plantings by crop type. Find a planting that you'd like to review and click on the Review button. This is the page where you submit your reviews for this planting. Please note that you do not need to fill out all your reviews at once. We encourage you to come back to the site throughout the season and review the traits applicable at that time. As you can see on my profile, this is a planting of beefsteak tomatoes I am growing in my garden this year. Let's go through the different areas you can enter reviews on this page. Dates button. These help you track dates associated with your plantings. Helpful dates to track include planting date, transplanting date if applicable, first harvest date, and last harvest date. These dates help us determine the days to maturity for each variety in your growing zone. Photos button. Here you can upload as many photos of each variety as you would like as you visually catalog your plants through the season. Comments button. You can add open comments about each variety throughout the season. Report failure button. If a particular variety dies before you are able to rate any traits, you can remove the variety with this button. Traits. These are the traits that you pick to evaluate for this planting. For each variety, click on Rate under the trait that you are evaluating. A pop-up comes up. Feel free to add a comment about your rating. Additionally, you are welcome to rate a trait more than once during the season. An example of this would be rating for disease resistance at first fruit harvest and adding a second rating for disease resistant at last harvest. Your progress. Last at the bottom of the page is where you can track your progress of data collection. Once your progress bar is at 100%, you are ready to complete your planting and submit your reviews. Click on the Complete Planting button in the upper right. Here we would like you to share a summary of your thoughts on each variety. Let us know if you'd grow each variety again, share final comments, and add a smiley, or not, for each. Then click Continue. Last, we appreciate feedback on the growing conditions your planting was exposed to. Let us know if your grow out of the varieties was successful or not, conventional or organic, along with the location, management, soil, light exposure, climate, and stress. Finally, share any overall management comments for the planting. Once filled in, select Complete Trial and you're done! So that is how you review your garden. Every rating you add to the Seedlink platform powers our Seed Explorer and helps our collective growing community find the right seed. Thank you for participating! 
If you are having any problems with your profile, please reach out to us at help at seedlinked.com. If you have any feedback on how to make the platform better, share your ideas with us at feedback at seedlinked.com.